All right, guys, we're back here in front of the Lotus Holland. I'm gonna give you guys a few tech tips in order for you guys to maintain this machine and get as clean of screens out of it as possible. This first chamber, this is where all the chemistry to remove the ink gets put in. I'm gonna open this up. One thing that we wanna do is we wanna make sure that the filter, we maintain this filter. And then every couple of months, we wanna remove the sludge off the bottom of this chamber. This second chamber, this is the emulsion remover. This chamber is really important in order to soften the emulsion and spray it off the screen. We use a pH strip to check and maintain the appropriate chemistry in this particular chamber. The final chamber of the Lotus is where the pressure washer is. This chamber is very important to keep clean. And one thing that you wanna look for is the tips of the pressure washer. If they get dirty, you're gonna have a difficult time washing the screen out. So I always recommend checking those tips once a week, maybe once every other week. One of the biggest benefits that I see with the Lotus Holland is the simplicity of it. One thing that I really, really like about it is what you see is what you get. If there's a problem with this machine, it's very, very easy to troubleshoot. Around the backside, You've got some pumps. The pumps and the motors control the chemistry. And then you have the motor that controls the screen going through the unit. So the engineering that was put into it, I really, really like. As you can see in the first chamber, we have some brushes on a chain drive. This agitates the emulsion and the ink as it goes through this chamber. These bars right here actually spray chemical on the screen. So the chemistry is being sprayed on and it's being agitated. As the screen moves through, it goes into this secondary chamber that applies the emulsion remover. Again, it's applied via these spray bars and you've got a pump on the back side of the machine. When you wanna change the chemistry, all you have to do is pump it out, clean the bottom of the tank, and then put new chemistry in there. It's a couple hour process from start to finish but once you dial in your chemistry, it will last months and months and months. This final chamber, this is the pressure washer assembly. So you can see the spray nozzles down here. This is what you want to maintain and be able to clean and look at once or twice a week.